Matty, I said at the top of the show that street circuits have got a unique and special character, a bit peculiar in many ways, but one of the real features, of course, is bumps. And look at Stephen Riches here. This is the bumps on the approach to turn three, and this is just a sample of the kind of stuff and the body language that goes with the explanation there to Phil Keady's engineer. Painted white lines on the track make braking a little tricky, and it caught out Craig Lowndes. There's big variations in the surface. You can see the concrete patching down there at turn number two. Another little trap on street circuits is often they plumb their way through shaded areas. Look at the leaf litter. That can be a factor in the races, gathering up in the front of the car, making the cars hot. And, of course, if it rains, or should I say when it rains, then those shady areas stay wet for longer. Talking point also, turn four, the chicane, the curbs are high. You talked before about Jamie Wincup breaking the front right suspension. He did it on the exit curbing on the front right-hand corner there. And so a little bit of attention to this area of the track yesterday as they reconfigured the tyre bundles at the apexes and had to think about it. Now, another big drama and a talking point yesterday, Will Davison, great run at the Grand Prix, great run at Eastern Creek, tough run yesterday, ended up up the wall and ripped the front right-hand corner out of that car. Very heavy impact down the right-hand side, and here's why on board. You'll see a little shutter here. Bang. He clipped the inside wall between turns six and seven. Camera went blank when he smacked the wall. Not surprising when you see that impact there in real time. And they carted the car away. They worked until 3.30 this morning. The good news, though, is that that car will take its place in qualifying today.